So basically we don't need a class because we've got a footer tag already. So we just target the footer instead of a class this time. So it's just footer parentheses font minus size colon 14 pixels to pass that one. Then we'll go to the next one. Step 8 of the default colour of a link that has not been clicked on is typically blue. The default colour of a link that has already been visited from a page is typically purple. To make the footer links the same colour regardless if a link has been visited, use a type selector for the anchor element and use the value black for the colour property. Right, here we go. To make the footer links the same colour regardless of the link has been visited, use a type selector for the anchor element and use the value black for the colour. So, 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 class equals So I'm going to do dot type. Oh no. Dot type parentheses colour colon black semicolon. If that's not it then I don't know. You should use an A selector. Ah, so again, we don't need the class. So we just use dot A then. Oh, do we not need to do it? We just use A. Ah, we just use A. Congratulations, your code passes. Submit your code and continue. So to pass that one, you need A selector. Just A, as in A for href. So A hyperlink reference. Free code count, blah, blah, blah. So when we click on that, it should work. In colour, colon, black, semicolon. And then it'll pass. You change, you change properties of a link when the link has actually been visited by using a pseudo selector that looks like a visited property name, property value. Change the colour of the footer visitor website link to grey when a user visited, visits the link. Change the colour of the footer visitor website to grey when a user visits the link. Right, so is it just a? I think it's just this, I'm not sure, but let's see a parentheses color colon gray minus spelt color c o l the American way. No. Sorry, your code does not pass. You should use an A visited pseudo selector. So A colon oh, visit visit mm, visited. Hey, yabba dabba, do you pass that one or not? Ah, see. So you need a pseudo selector A colon visited so when somebody visits it it goes grey sorry before somebody visited it goes grey sorry and when you click on it it gives you a link so normally this link would bring up another website it works this link so it's no bring up another website because it's no normally it would but it's all working fine So you change properties of a link when the mouse hovers over them. Use a 